Hey guys, it's me, Kayla, and little Orisia. And we are here today with his first update. Wow, he is five months and three weeks old. And we just left the doctor's office, and guess what? This big old bugger, he is 18 pounds. 18 pounds, and he is 25 inches long. Um, I stopped breastfeeding. I was breastfeeding up until he turned four months old. It was great while it lasted. I loved it. And it, I pumped at work, but it was hard to keep up my milk supply because he wasn't actually with me all day. So we got to the point where we were just breastfeeding at night and throughout the day we were given formula throughout the day. Um, and at night it felt like my milk was even getting lower because he would suck. Then he would still cry like he was hungry so I had to still give him formula. So about when he turned four months old we stopped completely. So he has been on formula for like a full month now. Um, he's on Prosobi Soy. Um, I'm cha I changed his milk today to the Gentle Lees. Uh, cons about it was it constipated the baby and everything. And guess what? It constipated my little booger big time. And likes about Oracion. Um, Oracion loves to smile. He is always smiling like anybody. Not a good good thing but bad thing at the same time because like a total stranger could come up to him and play with him and he's like this big happy baby smiling he loves absolutely loves music um in the car when we're going somewhere you have have to have the music on because if the music is not on he's gonna whine he's gonna scream bloody murder so you have to put music on all the time Oracion loves to be held and he started holding his own bottle uh, he says mama only when he wants something like if I'm not paying attention to him and um, like I just drift away and he's trying to get my attention he will say mama that's not daddy's all time favorite he plays with his feet uh, he loved, that was the first thing before everything, like when he turned five months, his feet, he loved his feet. He would just like hold them and try to eat on them all the time, like that was his all time favorite thing. Um, we just started letting him play with little toys now, like the little teddy bears with the little teething rings on it. Um, I believe he's starting to tease because he eats on everything, always eating his hands and all the time. So must-haves. The must-haves we always have to have. Bibs. Always have to have bibs because Oration is always throwing up. Must-haves have to be this little bouncer. It is such a lifesaver. When I have to go to the restroom, I know he's going to cry. So I take him and the bouncer with me. And he doesn't cry. Um, when I'm cooking, I take the bouncer in the kitchen and I put some music on on my tablet, on my phone. And he lets me cook. Um, a swing. His swing is an all ultimate must have because um, we have three things we have the bouncer, the swing, and then we have the bouncer that you hang up on the little ceiling or in a doorway. Oh, that's the third thing. When he gets tiresome in one, we put him in the other because we don't want to have to hold him all the time because we don't want to get him used to being held all the time. Pacifier. He has to have his pacifier to sleep. Um, Throughout the day, when he's fussy, we would give him his pacifier. Then he was probably spit it out. But during the night, he has to have his pacifier because he wakes up during the night. And when he wakes up during the night, he normally wants his pacifier. We put it in his mouth and he'll just roll over and go back to sleep. Um, he's sleeping in his bassinet. He has a, um, a little bassinet that goes on the side of my bed. We never quite put him in the pack and play yet. Because the pack and play is a lot bigger to put on the side of my bed. Plus, we already had the bassinet and we wanted to put it to use. So right now, um, he's in the bassinet. I think he feel a little more cozier. Poor baby, it's okay. He feels a little more cozier in the um, bassinet. 
Um, he sleeps pretty much. Uh, he goes down at 8:30. Um, he sleeps pretty good at night. He go to bed at 8.30, wake up around 12 for a bottle. We give him his bottle. Um, then he'll sleep uh, pretty much all night. I would say about till 5. At 5 would be his next feeding because that will be almost the time when I'm about to wake up to dress they say for school. Um, I'll feed him at that time. Uh, but he sleeps pretty much during the night. Now sometimes, not every night is successful. Um, some nights he will uh, whine throughout the night just to get in my bed and once he's in the middle of me and EJ in the bed he's good again he go right back to sleep but as if for being up all night whining all night no that's not really him for clothes for clothes he is in a size 18 month clothes um some shorts he could still fit six to nine and three to six but it has to be stretchy and um, these little shorts that's on him now is actually three to six months and they fit him. Um, but 18 month onesies. But when it comes to a regular outfit, like a full outfit with a little dress shirt and the bottom, I would say 12 month. Shoes, he's in a size two shoe. Um, I think he has like maybe six pairs of shoes now. Loves his sister. He loves Say Say. Like Say Say makes him laugh. Like laugh. Now he does great with his dad his dad could actually like um see me she will cry whine do the whining thing to go down to bed i have to rock like rock 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 and you see how i'm bouncing this bouncer right now he is actually sleeping because i'm bouncing this bouncer but her his dad all his dad has to do is roll him on his side and he falls asleep no questions asked but for me, I have to bounce, I have to sing a song, I have to do everything to get him down. But that's a mama for you because that's the life of a mother because they want extra attention from mommy. I believe that is it. That is everything on his five month update. Um, he is big and healthy as y'all can see, my big 18 pound boy. I think that'll be it because I have a tiresome baby right now and he didn't take a nap since early and I had to wake him up from the nap. So I'm going to see y'all later on my next video. And thanks for watching. Make sure you comment, like, and subscribe. And make sure you check out our vlog channels.